In Centerville, Virginia, they will be honoring the Citizen of the Year this weekend. Celeste Peterson lost her only child in the Virginia Tech massacre, and in the 15 years since, she's led an organization created to honor her daughter. Northern Virginia Bureau Chief Julie Carey looks at her work and how it's helped hundreds of people. Finding and fulfilling community needs is what drives Celeste Peterson. This is 15 years that we have been doing this. Um, started the same year that Aaron was killed. What Celeste started 15 years ago was the Aaron Peterson Fund, an organization created to honor her daughter and only child. Aaron was one of 32 people who died in the Virginia Tech shooting in 2007. We started out with just giving away scholarships, right? And we still give away scholarships. A young men's leadership group was set up, then another club for girls. The fund also buys new coats for elementary aged kids. After Celeste learned there were some coming to school in winter without them. It physically hurt. It felt like, I was like, oh, we're going we gonna to stop that. So we started um, working with the school social worker at um, Centerville Elementary. The fund's work continuing to expand, more recently stocking nearby schools with food and snack bags for children who need them. Celeste says while she was raised in a family who helped others, it was Erin's giving as a teenager that most inspired her. She would show these acts of kindness that were not in me, not innately like they were with her. And just watching that, she forced me to look at the world differently. She left a great compass as to what it was I was supposed to do when she was she was gone. Celeste's work also now a tribute to her husband, who passed away in 2016. I miss my family so, so much, and um, she, she keeps me, okay, it's okay to cry, Mom, but we gotta help people. Now, Celeste herself is being honored, named as the Centerville Citizen of the Year. I am truly, truly humbled by it. I mean, truly humbled. But Celeste is far from finished. She says she has more ideas to put into action and her dream, a youth and senior center that would bear her daughter's name. In Centerville, I'm Julie Carey, News 4. A small project to start that expanded tremendously. So work. deserving of the honor as well. Yes, indeed.